Okay, we're back here at TB's uh, uh, portable blacksmith shop and trying to get the steel to melt still yet. Get it hot enough to shape into something. So far, this I've got nine pounds of charcoal, and so far it hasn't done too much softening of that metal. You see, to melt steel, you got to get it up at least 3,000 Fahrenheit in order to get it to pound out. I believe it's 3,000 Fahrenheit, but anyhow, it's got to be a lot hotter than what this charcoal is burning. Okay, now this, granted, this is the cheapest charcoal I get at Walmart's, but I was just trying to do it where it's cheaper for a poor man or any any average citizen could build their own knives for kitchenware or hunting knife or, or anything they want to build from steel. And so far, from, I don't think much of it, what they're telling on YouTube. They claim that charcoal is supposed to melt steel. Well, I'm going to give it a chance. Don't get me wrong, but if it doesn't, if it doesn't melt, the, you know, soften the steel to where you can bend it down and shape it into what you want it, it's just really not that worth a darn to you. You did, I like me, I've just wasted a bunch of charcoal, yeah, basically. Now, what I can do with this when I'm done, if it doesn't make a knife, I can burn me a hamburger over it. That's about what it's good for. At this point, I'm not too happy with the situation. Now, that being said, TB's getting ready to try to bend that steel again. I get it hot enough. I'm gonna see if I can hammer out a knife out of that. Today, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the steel to work down flat enough to, or get hot enough to where you can do anything with it, but I'm going to give it a shot. Just because they say it can be done up there on, on the YouTube don't always mean it works. We're going to see if it does. I'm not calling them a liar yet, but we'll let the public be the judge when I get done here. You know, you be the judge. If it doesn't bend that carbon steel and it don't get hot on charcoal, you know, it ain't worth a darn to. You see how fast my charcoal is burning up? Of course, I got the air on it continuously, trying to keep it hot enough, that coal, to get that steel hot enough to do what you want. I think it's going to be too expensive to use charcoal. Because by the time you burn up several pounds of charcoal, just to heat that damn, that steel, pardon my French, the steel, you're going to wind up spending too much money, to be honest with you. And this is TB telling you that, but you can be the judge yourself. All right, I'm getting ready to pound out a piece of steel. Let me set this camera up where maybe you'll be able to see me. I'm not sure, but we're going to give it a try. I don't have a tripod. I've got a plastic bucket. There it is. That's why it's going to be hanging in off my clothes lying in my backyard. All right, here it goes. Hang on. <coughs> There we go. I'll try to set it up where you can watch me work this steel now. Well, if I can get that wind to let the bucket alone, it's going to whip it around a lot. I see that. Hang on. Let me see if I can pin it down. Get the clothespin on there. All right. I know it. I ain't got much of stuff to work with here. But anyway, here we go. All right. Now, I don't know if you can see me, but... I'm getting ready to pull this piece of steel. It's nothing but an X longbow blade. It's no good for nothing, but it is charcoal. It is hardened carbon steel. We're using charcoal to try to heat it. With what they claim up on YouTube is supposed to heat the steel where you can make knives and stuff out of it. Now, files is good for making knives, but I still think you need coal. I noticed Dave was using coal up on YouTube. Let's see if that's hot enough. There it is, it's cherry red, so I gotta get busy. Check this out. First I want to flatten that steel. Yeah. It is getting hot enough, but it may cost more than it's worth. Well, that's 
pretty warm. I may have to put it back in the pot. And the truck's going to let it heat some more. That gun, I got the wrong glow. That's all. We'll go ahead and put it back in the truck. Anyway, it, it is getting a little bit. starting to heat it up, so maybe it will. But I think it's going to cost a lot more than coal, because coal don't burn as fast as charcoal. It's darn charcoal is burning too fast. Hardwood. I got nine pounds of charcoal for the heart. So I figured I'd have to use Use all that much, actually. Alright, we're going to try it again. It, it got red, so maybe it will. We'll see if it's going to really work out or if it's just another myth buster. But it is, it is heating it. It's just taking a long time to do it. If we'd had actual coal, we'd done had it. Some. We got some steel heating up now. I'll let that heat up for another 20, 30 minutes and time to see what happens. But there it is. So I tell you what, I'm gonna turn off the camera, save the battery. And uh, when I get ready to beat it out again, I'll turn it back on and you'll be able to see what's going on. We'll see if we're going to be able to make a knife out of that junk or not. Okay, hang on folks, bear with me.